change that one too, boy. Big shout, big, big, and Bruce Oxenford has got up the right index finger. First one, he's got to say it's deserved. He started beautifully here, has Patel. Yeah, great length, beautiful, nice and full. A couple of deliveries did not spin, went straight with the arm, and this one just turned and turned sharply. And Imam ul Haq made the mess of it actually he could have easily played that from the front foot because it was pretty full he went back and done your beauty three maidens and a wicket for a debutante 40 for one pakistan There's the yeah! free shot, catch it, is the call. Umpire says not out. They think that uh, there's a glove involved. They've gone for a review. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, uh, third umpire to director. We have a review for LBW. Yes, LBW. And uh, we'll, the original season not out, and we'll go to front foot first, please. Fair delivery. Okay, ultra edge now. Just rock and rolling that. Yep. Yep, okay. And the ball goes up. Can you run that right through to the catch? And we got a catch. I'll go back to the umpire on ground, please. Okay, we've got glove involved, and I'll get you to change the decision to out. You're on screen now. What a big call, and a correct call. And Pakistan have lost the skipper, who was looking just a little bit tentative and nervous. Once again, playing the sweep shot and paying the price. Pakistan have lost six now, 154 for the loss of six, two wickets for the debutant. It's skipper goes after scoring just three, 154 for six. And of course, uh, a couple of half centuries there with Watling and Nichols. Yeah! It's all over! Bilal trying to be a hero here and heave it over mid wicket for six, has missed. And is Gonski the slog across the line, trying to take that target away and try to get him in big shots? It was a subtle change in feel, and he's just gone right across and missed it. Middle stump. First test match, and what a test match for this man. Ijaz Patel, he can't believe his luck. And Bilal Asif, second ball slog, doesn't work out without scoring. Pakistan now, seven down, still need 22. Oh, and he does. Up in the air, Saudi! Oh, oh, yeah! Now he's taken it! He is! He has taken the hook, line and sinker here, has Hassan Ali. What a really good catch under pressure from the substitute, Tim Saudi. Brilliant. Hassan Ali didn't disappoint, he had a go. And there was a deep mid wicket in place. Azhar Ali is furious. Pakistan crowd can't believe this. But it was coming. And 
Masanari trying to clear the boundary, trying to hit a six. And it's not middle lit and it comes out as a treat for the Black Caps. A terrific catch under pressure. Tim Saudi very comfortable under that. And what has Hassan Ali done? It, New Zealand love that. Ijaz Patel loves that. Pakistan, not so much. Hassan Ali out without scoring. Pakistan, 164 for nine. And 12 runs to win. And guess what? It strings. What a win! What a win! Maybe we just got to wait for that. But what a delivery! Spun sharply. Third umpire to director. We have a review for LBW. Original decision is out. Front foot first, please. Fair delivery. Then we go in front on spin vision, please. Yeah. Doesn't look like bat. We'll just have Ultra Edge to confirm that, please. Thank you. Yeah, it's clearly no bat. We can go to ball tracking when ready. Okay. We have Hawkeye now. Original decision is out. It's pitching in line. It's impact in line. And it's hitting the wickets. Umpire's call. We will go back to Bruce on ground. You can stick with the original decision. You're on screen now. Thank you. And what a victory for the New Zealanders. They deserve it. Wow. Well, all right, Waka Yunus. It's an unbelievable victory for New Zealand. You can see how much it means to them. Defending 175. A bold New Zealand, uh, Pakistan out for 171. Ajaz Patel, 5 for 59. On test debut, made in five for bowling New Zealand to victory. Absolutely superb.